few centuries ago, the access to water in the desert part of Morocco was problematic, not as easy as nowadays. To irrigate their pieces of land, people in the southeast of Morocco used to build what's called Khtara, which is an old irrigation system that was also used in other parts of the world. They basically dig a series of wells from the source of water all the way to their farming fields. These wells are linked together by an underground tunnel. The tunnel should not obviously be parallel to the ground, otherwise it would be impossible to ensure the streaming of water. Sometimes water gets blocked by something in the way, mostly by sand as the region gets a lot of sandstorms throughout the year. In this case people start checking every single well starting from the field side. Once they find water in the well and not in the next one, they know that whatever is blocking the streaming of water is located in between these two wells. The next step is to clear the way. To do that a man or two have to go down with a bucket or something and do the job, of course with the help of other men standing on the top of the well. But that's not the impressive part. To build the system, every family in the village must dedicate a male member to participate in the constructions. It was a job for men, not women. If a family doesn't participate, then it won't get its share of water once the system is running. If a family has no male members, or if there's any condition that made it impossible for the man of the family to work, then the family must pay a sum of money to someone to do the job for them. This whole system was handmade using very simple basic tools and resources. Thank you for watching.